Welcome back. It is now 723. Theater Works begins its 40th season at UCCS this month at the Dusty Lou Bon Vivant Theater. And there are a lot of special performances taking place all month long. And this morning, John Martin gets a live and local preview. John, good morning. Hey, good morning, Craig. Good morning, Kimberly. Yes, 40 years, which is which is huge for anything, especially we're talking about theater. Theater Works is celebrating their 40th anniversary. Uh, we have a performance called Private Lives starting tomorrow at 7.30 uh, here at the Dusty Lou Bon Vaughn Theater. Uh, Mark is an actor in, in this performance. First of all, let, let's set the scene for people and tell uh, those who are not familiar with this performance what Private Lives actually it's. So, Private Lives is a farce written by Noel Coward. Uh, in it, I play uh, Elliot Chase, who's a man who is newly married to a beautiful young woman. Uh, they're on their honeymoon in a, a resort in France, and they realize in pretty short order that they're staying right next door to my ex-wife and her new husband, who are also on their honeymoon. And so the first part of the play is basically them sort of missing each other uh, by small degrees, and then the realization uh, that the two of us have, me and my ex-wife, that we are in fact sharing a balcony with our new spouses. Well, that's uh, and, then, and, then, and then the rest of the play kind of devolves from there. What do you think that people are really going to enjoy about this most? I mean, we've been talking about it all morning, but in this theater, you're kind of on top of the action. There's a lot of uh, intimate moments, I guess, that they get to be a part of. What do you think that they're going to enjoy quite possibly the most? I think, I mean, what, what Noel Coward has to say about relationships and love and the stupid things that we do and the choices <laughs> we make and, and, you know, the assumptions that we have about the people that we're in love with and so on, I think I'll, uh, everyone can relate to them. Um, the farce that is marriage, <laughs> quite frankly, that, that was something he was really interested in. And in a space this small, this particular theater, which is so beautiful, uh, you know, you're so close to the action, you're so close to the actors. I, I really think they're going to feel like they're part of what's going on on stage. I certainly hope they will. We're kind of wrapping up here, but uh, this is the 40th anniversary for Theater Works. What do you think? This is not your first time here either. It is not. What do you think it is um, that's being done here that's kind of propelled this uh, to, to go for four decades? Yeah, I, I, the you know the thing that's uh, I was here about seven years ago doing another Noel Coward play, uh, Blythe Spirit, and. I was impressed then, and as I am now, you know, the commitment of the people here, their passion for theater, their passion for, for art, um, the audiences that are sort of smart and engaged and interested and keep coming out and supporting arts in this community. Uh, it's, it's a pleasure to be here, and I, I have no doubt that TheaterWorks will have another 40 years based on the audience's response to their work so far. Well, dig it. You can be a part of that audience private live starting tomorrow at 7.30 for all the information you can possibly handle, go to theaterworkscs.org. And don't forget that's theater with an R-E, because oh, it's fancy. They're fancy, It's yes. fancy. <laughs> <laughs> John, thanks. Great set, great talent, and, yeah. and that's a real famous play, too, so it's great to have it here. Sounds like a, like a, a sticky situation, yeah. for sure, yeah. <laughs>